<clears throat> malabsorption of vitamin B12 and intrinsic factor during biguanide therapy. Now, biguanides are the most popular class of drugs for type 2 diabetes. An intrinsic factor is a protein secreted by the lining of the stomach, and as far as we know, its only job, its only role, is to bind with vitamin B12 so that B12 can get absorbed. Here's a study saying that people that take this class of diabetic medications, the biguanides, it impairs your body's ability to produce intrinsic factor. And the clinician states here, biguanides can induce malabsorption by two different mechanisms. One is temporary and unrelated to intrinsic factor, but the other causes permanent decline in intrinsic factor secretion. What this means is that a lot of people who are taking this diabetic medication are permanently going to be hindered in their ability to absorb vitamin B12. So I try to get all pharmacists to recommend to their patients that are taking these diabetic biguanide uh, drugs, make sure they're on vitamin B12 supplementation. Because if you are B12 deficient over time, not only do you get low in energy, you don't metabolize your homocysteine, so you have accelerated cardiovascular disease, but over time, you can have neurological damage, and that is long-term and irreversible. I don't want anybody to get that far down the line. And for pennies a day, you can do B12 supplementation and prevent that problem.